Welcome to this evening's uh, concert organized by the Institute Cultural Association, IMSC Cultural Association, where we'll have a Veena recital by Dr. Ram Naidu, accompanied by Srimati N.S. Raja Mandalavan. Um, I'll start by introducing the teacher of uh, Ram, Nai Ram uh, Srimati Vidya Shankar. Uh, Ram is here for the centenary celebrations of uh, Vidyama, and uh, we are proud to have him play here for us on that occasion. Vidya Shankar is, uh, was a Vainika vocalist, musicologist, and teacher, um, born in 1919 and passed away in 2010. She was taught by Sabhesha Ayer, Sabhapati Ayer, Shama Shastri, not to be confused with uh, the great composer Shama Shastri, but a descendant of his, and T. L. Venkataramayar. At least two of these I know are Sangeeta Kalamithi, Sabesha Iyer, and T. L. Venkataramayar. She presented numerous lecture demonstrations, and she is the author of several articles and books, and she was for a long time on the Experts Committee of the Music Academy. Um, Ram is one of her senior students and he has accompanied her for over two decades, two decades in concerts and lecture demonstrations. And as I mentioned, he is here in connection with the celebrations of uh, the centenary of Srimati Vidya Shankar. Uh, so many of you may know that yesterday there was a um, session at the morning conference at the Mu Music Academy in um, memory of uh, Srimati Vidya Shankar, where um, Ram was playing the Veena in, um, he was also accompanied by, uh, where Ram and uh, Nitya were the presenters of that program. Um, Ram has uh, inherited her Veena and I think he's playing on that. Yes. And um, one of the things Ram did yesterday was to share with us the, ins the insights he has uh, uh, imbibed, received from Srimati Vidya Shankar on the compositions of Shama Shastri. Uh, he spoke about both the emotional content, um, emotional and lyrical, lyrical content on the one hand, and all the, the, also the musical content and the how the gamaka should be played for uh, uh, for the music. Um, it was a wonderful presentation and uh, I'm sure we are uh, going to have uh, see a demonstration of those things here as well. Uh, uh, the Mridanga player this evening is uh, Srimati N.S. Rajam. She is uh, a Kalai Mamani awardee and she happens to be the sister of uh, Sangeeta Kalanithi uh, flute uh, Ramani. Sir. I, I'm, uh, um, I'll say a few things about Srimati Vidya Shankar. Um, uh, that I am, you know, uh, with, uh, that has a personal connection to me. Um, I mean, before I came to know Sundar, um, my senior colleague here, who happens to be Vidya Shankar, one of Vidya Shankar's sons, um, I happened to know Vidya Shankar before I met Sundar through her books of music. Uh, what attracted me to her books was the fact that. Uh, unlike, for example, many other books written, for example, by, uh, say, Samba Murthy, uh, the language was very, the prose was attractive and uh, what one is used to as a scientist. <laughs> um, and the second thing, that, that's perhaps a minor point, but uh, nevertheless, uh, that was an attraction for me. It was written, uh, you know, even a the standards of uh, exposition are those uh, that, that we are used to in science rather than uh, those in music, which are, I'm, if I may say so, are not that great. The second one is, um, um, is more, more, more precise and I am rather disappointed that nobody at the Music Academy mentioned this. It is that we all pay lip service to the Sangeeta Sampradaya Pradarshini being the being a great uh, tome of music and uh, I say this as an amateur so I am open to correction. Um, 
but i i got familiar with the sangeet sampradaya pradarshini as a graduate student um and was looking for any uh, a, you know for literature that post the sangeet sampradaya pradarshini which would follow its style or improve upon its style and the only only publication i know to this date that does is vidya amma's books okay so uh, I, unfortunately this was not mentioned in the music academy I, I, like i said i'm open to correction here i'm saying this as an amateur and uh, i must mention one of the things in her books that is that is an improvement on the sangeeta sampradaya pradarshini and for example for a yarak jaru or an yetra jaru so if you are for say for example the previous note is ma pa and you are coming and the re comes down you sing the re from you pull it down from above then the sankita sampradaya pradarshini only gives a downward slash to re whereas in vidya ma's books there is a small small print of either for example pa or ma saying which note it should the drag should start from which is um an improvement on the sangeeta sampradaya pradarshini so um for me personally this uh, her books uh, continue to be a um a source of pleasure so uh, over to ram and shrimati rajan for the concert thank you um this is a beautiful hall thank you sundar it's really quite beautiful it's um, it's a pleasure to be here uh um, before i start i just want to say i called raja mami and i said we're having this program would you be willing to play and she readily agreed and she had the most wonderful things to tell me about my guru about how they had had such a good relationship for many many years thank you mami um you mentioned sangeeta sampradaya pradarshini yes uh, vidyama's books expanded that notation and she demystified it for all of us in our playing and teaching and we were very fortunate for that uh, her knowledge was so great we had to choose some small amount to showcase so i'll we'll remember that for next time that's really a good point you made uh today's concert uh, is based on all the pieces i learned from her pieces she liked pieces she liked me to play and pieces that showcased a, a showcase a range of knowledge that she um had gained and i had a deep understanding of for many many years so most of you will know all these pieces so i i won't announce them unless they are um <clears throat> things that are i haven't played before but um uh, i'll i'll let you uh, guess till the piece begins and then i can announce it at the end if that's okay thank you <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
So that piece uh, uh, is called Ninne Bhajana by Tyagaraja Swami in Nata Raga, said to Adi Tal. Mm-hmm. 
It's a composition of Shyama Shastri in Tamil. Sit to Oh, <laughs> 
Oh, 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 oh,
So I was a little bit concerned how I will play the Pallavi without hearing anything. <clears throat> I'm in a better shape now. Uh, this Pallavi was taught to me by Vidyama. She played it in 1947. Then she played it again in 1980. And uh, she, we heard her sing a lot of Kritis and play a lot of Kritis, but she actually used to play Ragam Tanam Pallavi. And she taught me many Pallavis. This one is in Bhairavi. Unad padam tune ye or armuhane armuhane in Adita mm -hmm. and Amma in the left any was. This is how the Pallavi goes. Unad padam tune. Or Mugane, Ad Mugane, Muna de Padam, Muna Yem, Or Mugane, Ad Mugane, Muna de Padam, Muna Yem.
Can I? Uh, that was Ranjani Mala. Um, Sundar, can I take 10 minutes more? Is that okay? For, I was going to stop at 8, but I was going to play one more song. I would like to play a Padam that Amma taught me, Thiruvati or Thyagarajan, Nathanam. And uh, it's a very beautiful padam. <clears throat> Sit to Rupa Katana. Thank 
I will now play Tillana, yeah, composed by Veena Seshanam in Darbari, Canada. Uh, actually, I didn't learn this from Amma, but she liked it very much and she used to always ask me to play it in all the programs. So today, because of that, I'm going to play it. Um, it's uh, Darbari, Canada, Adi Taan. Thank you. 
Thank you everyone for coming. Uh, at the beginning of the concert, I played under some difficulty. I couldn't hear what I was doing, but I think the second half was okay. Thank you. I think we are all just overwhelmed today. So Ram being here and playing all her favorite songs, I am a total wreck. The last song Vidyama played in Delhi when we went for the her award and Anka Kachiri Kurta. She was so old. You know, by the time they give this award, people are in their wheelchairs. Why can't they give it earlier? It was so special. Always every song is special, what you played. And uh, it was wonderful to relive. And so many of us here, all our uh, students are here. And we all have thousands of memories. I think Vara Varsham, we should not stop with this. See, her birthday has just started. So let us meet, let us do stuff. If anybody can arrange, we can meet. We, we should remember her on all her special days. She used to gather us together and we used to uh, do it in Ravana. Uh, I mean, p p p p p we used to do for Ganesh Chaturthi, Navaratri, set our songs, Shulli Gurthi. Uh, Ram, if you are planning to come next year anytime, let us know. I know you've come twice this year because he came in August and we thought this Music Academy will give us time next year, you know, completion of her birthday. So this year itself we are giving. So he had to come back in December, which he did. Because without Ram, yesterday's thing wouldn't have happened. No chance. So, uh, team effort, uh, we are so, so happy that you are here. And thank you so much. And Amma Romba you coming and being here. It's wonderful because we've sung together all the five years of Navaratri we have done in Marundishwar Kovilla and the Kalyan Lakshmi Anand Lakshmi Vittila. So, so many memories come rushing. So, uh, her memory will never, I mean, it will be with us till our last breath, I'm sure. Thank you so much.